Ethan? We're too late. The missile's in the air. These missions may be impossible for most, but they aren't for Ethan Hunt. It's much worse than you think. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 Mission Impossible moments. Yours? You hung me on the side of an airplane. You can always tell someone's character by the way they treat those they don't need to treat well. If you are sure. Don't threaten me. For this list, we're taking a look at the most exciting scenes from the Mission Impossible film franchise. As always, be warned that there are likely to be spoilers ahead. And we're not just talking about the ones attached to flipping cars. It's Brassel. I think he's working with Davian. I think I'm being set up. Number 10. Motorcycle Chase. Mission Impossible 2. Good morning, Mr. Hunt. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, involves recovery of a stolen item designated Chimera. This Mission Impossible sequel has Ethan Hunt looking to destroy a genetically created disease called Chimera. Transfer completed. After Hunt successfully disguises himself to retrieve the antivirus, you'd think the mission would be over. But Hunt soon finds himself in quite some trouble as villain Sean Ambrose pursues him. The resulting action from the ensuing motorcycle chase is intense enough, as we see them speed and swerve around other cars, shoot guns, and even go off the road. But it's Hunt and Ambrose running into each other that really makes the scene stand out. It's director John Woo at his craziest. Number 9. Rabbit Foot Interrogation, Mission Impossible 3. I mean, you saw what I did to your little blonde friend at the factory, right? This scene from the third Mission Impossible gives viewers a glimpse of Hunt's moral complexity. After his protege, Lindsay Ferris, is killed with an explosive device that's been implanted in her head, Hunt captures arms dealer Owen Davian. You're dead, Mr. Davian. Following an unsuccessful verbal interrogation during which Hunt attempts to discover Davian's future plans involving the rabbit's foot, Hunt hangs the baddie out of a plane as a threat in the hopes that he'll talk. What is the rabbit's foot? It is riveting and has viewers holding their breath as we wonder just how far the hero will go to get information. What I'm selling and who I'm selling to is the last thing you should be concerned about. Number 8. Plane Ride, Mission Impossible, Rogue Nation. Benji. Benji, do you copy? Just when you think this franchise can't get any crazier, Rogue Nation brings us this insane opening scene. The package is still on the plane. We learn that Hunt is trying to obtain a package from a cargo plane, so he jumps onto the aircraft in an attempt to break in. Benji, can you open the door? Uh, can I open the door? Uh, maybe. Benji Dunn, played by Simon Pegg, has a little trouble opening the right door, however. By the time he figures it out, the plane is already in the air, with our hero hanging off the side of it. That's the wrong door! Benji, not that door, the other door! The audience waits in suspense as Hunt hangs on for dear life, and the moment is especially thrilling because of the danger that the IMF agent is facing. Look, I'm gonna open the parador. How's that? With moments like this, it's difficult to believe, but also impressive to realize, that Tom Cruise does so many of his own stunts. Hey, hey. Number 7. Prison Break. Mission Impossible Ghost Protocol. Let's give you a few friends to play with. This opening scene finds Hunt inside a Moscow prison as he escapes along with his source, Bogdan. As the IMF opens the doors to extract him, 
the other inmates burst out of their cells and join in fighting the guards. This setup results in a scene with tons of great choreography and prepares viewers for the intense action presented throughout Ghost Protocol. If you like to watch people battle it out and you're into prison escapes, this scene and this movie is definitely for you. Number 6. Chasing Ilsa – Mission Impossible – Rogue Nation Though she's a syndicate operative, Ilsa Faust appears to be on the IMF side. She helps Hunt infiltrate an underwater tank and even saves his life before he can drown. However, as soon as he's conscious, she steals the flash drive and drives off. We got it. We're gonna nail that. <laughs> The resulting chase between the IMF and Faust brings mind-boggling car stunts to the big screen, including motorbikes, 4x4s, and driving through pedestrian streets. Do you have your seatbelt on? Will you ask me that now? In addition to how action-packed it is, the scene engages viewers by making us examine Ilsa's moral complexity. We good? Things got a little out of hand. Ah! Look out! Number 5. Train Tunnel Fight – Mission Impossible Tonight's in the tunnel! No, don't, don't! It'll crash into us! Accelerate! Accelerate! In one of the most famous scenes from the franchise, Ethan hangs onto a train in order to capture John Voight's Jim Phelps. During the chase, Hunt avoids getting hit by a passing train and being cut by the blades of a helicopter. This scene is memorable not only because of the great odds that Hunt overcomes, but also because it appears in one of the first action movies to so seamlessly blend CGI and live action. My lawyers are going to have a field day with this. Number 4. Kremlin Infiltration – Mission Impossible – Ghost Protocol We're going into the Kremlin. In order to infiltrate the Kremlin and obtain information, the IMF team comes up with one of the most creative strategies in the franchise. As they use the projection screen to sneak past the guard, the audience feels the tension because we all know that one mistake alone could get the team in serious trouble. And in that respect, Benji almost gets the team caught when he puts his face in front of the camera. But because they don't, the moment is instead hilarious. This winning combination of intelligence, humor, and very few sound effects makes this scene one of the most memorable in the franchise. It's empty. The nest is empty. Number 3. Jack's Death – Mission Impossible Abort! Do you read me? The setup of this scene leads viewers to believe that the IMF team will successfully break into the American Embassy in Prague and prevent the IMF non-official cover list from being stolen. Ethan Hunt will be your point man, as usual. He is now in Kiev and will rendezvous in Prague at a safe house of your choosing. However, they are too late and become victims of traps that were previously set for the team. As the members are killed off, well, not Hunt, of course, viewers are shocked and saddened. Jack Harmon's impaling is particularly difficult to watch. Jack. 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 Scenes like this are rare for action movies, and as such, the moment establishes the unpredictability of the rest of the franchise. This is Ethan Hunt. They're dead. Wait, who's They're dead? My team! My team is dead! Number 2. Climbing the Burj Khalifa – Mission Impossible – Ghost Protocol I'm telling you, we can get to it from outside. We? Oui? Even with its fourth entry, this franchise scaled new heights. In Ghost Protocol, the IMF team heads to the Burj Khalifa for a mission. 
But after learning that access to the server room is limited, Hunt scales the Burj Khalifa. You know, the world's tallest artificial structure. What the hell is that? Hunt has sticky gloves, but they malfunction, and he has to use his bare hands. 23 minutes to door knock. There are several things that make this scene unforgettable, like the jaw-dropping view of the skyscraper and the stunning height that the scene is filmed at. Most notable, though, is perhaps the knowledge that Tom Cruise performed the act himself. This stunt is as dangerous as it gets, and audiences really felt the danger as they watched Cruise hang on for dear life. I'm in. That's great, Ethan. You're halfway home. Before we unveil our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. You want to shake hands with the devil? That's fine with me. I just want to make sure that you do it in hell. Mr. Phelps. I'm not the only one who's seen you alive. You son of a bitch. It's over, Jim. Number one, infiltrating the vault, Mission Impossible. Okay, Luther, I'm going in. Arguably the most famous scene in the franchise, Hunt finds himself inside a vault to steal an important list. Even though Hunt has great skills, the stakes are raised even higher than usual since the vault in question, located in CIA headquarters, has head sensors, motion sensors, and pressure sensors. If that isn't intense enough, a rat shows up to complicate things. Viewers can't help but be entranced as Hunt completes his mission without fault. Miss. The action and intensity in this scene ultimately set the bar for future action scenes in the Mission Impossible film series, and leave us feeling breathless every time. Oh my god. Do you agree with our list? What do you think is the best Mission Impossible scene? Another route. Turn left, up ahead, take the alley on the right. For more engaging top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Would you consider the cinema of the Caribbean? Aruba, perhaps.